Hello, teacher. Can you hear me? Yes. Yes. Okay, sorry, I lost connection for several minutes. That's okay, okay. teacher. Don't worry. Okay, let's go back to the main session. Okay. Okay. All right, can you hear me? Yes, we can hear you now. Okay, good. Uh, yes, all right. Yes, okay, sorry that I lost connection for several minutes. I was trying to uh, come back to the session, but it took me a little while. Um, any questions about how to use um, the simple past, past continuous and used to? Present perfect, past perfect, when we're talking about past activities? No. No? It's clear. Okay, good. Uh, let me show you. I don't know if you have gotten to this part of the platform. Um, when we are using this right here. Let me show you this. Okay, can you see my screen? Past yes. rules and phrasal rules of obligation? Yes, we can see it. Yes. Okay. Should, uh, uh, I was supposed to, I had to, I didn't have to, or I needed to. Uh, all of them, they express obligations uh, that you were imposed in the, in the, in the past tense. So should have, was supposed to, had to, needed to, and all describe obligations in the past. Although they sometimes have different uses. Okay, I need a volunteer to read the first example. I should have. Uh -huh. I should have to stay home and study. It was a good idea, but I didn't do it. Thank you. I should have stayed home and studied. How do you say that one in Spanish? Yo debería. Debería, debería what? Haber. Haberme quedado. Haberme quedado en, quedado en casa y estudiar. Uh -huh. And what is the message? The person did not stay home. Haber right? <laughs> right? How do you say hubiera ahorrado mm -hmm. todo el año? Estudiar y, estu y haber estudiado. Hubiera, hubiera ahorrado todo el año. I should have. I should have. I should have saved. I should have saved. I should have saved money all the year. All the year. Right. Now the second one says, "I was supposed to be studying this weekend." I was supposed to. So imagine this person is at the beach right now. And he's telling his friend, man, I was supposed to be studying this weekend and I'm here with you guys. It was required, but the person did not do it. Look at number three. I had to wear a uniform. I had to wear a uniform. Is that optional or mandatory? Mandatory. 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 Okay. Did you have to wear a uniform when you were in school? Yeah. Yes. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Public um, or private, there was always a uniform. Uh, then yes. the other one says, I didn't have to go out to go with my friends, but I did. So I didn't have to. So it was like optional. And then I thought I needed to have more clothes. So I thought I needed. Now, what you think? doesn't necessarily express that the idea is true. Any questions or comments about this?
Is this information clear? Yeah, I think it is. Yeah. yeah. Okay, so let me, let's do an exercise. Let me see this here. The internet connection is not good right now. So let me see if I can open uh, my Gmail account. It looks like it was fixed. It's running. No. So, module one. Okay, 2.2, .2, knowledge check. Okay, let's see if I can open this. All right, can you see 2.2? .2? Yes. Okay, uh, volunteer to read number one. I shouldn't have invited them. Okay, and what is the answer, uh, what is the message for that sentence? I invite them. I invited them, but now you regret it. She said, I shouldn't have invited them. So what is the message? You invited them, but now, uh, what do you call it? Now you regret it. Very good. What about number two? That was a secret. You weren't supposed to tell anyone. What is you, the message? You told someone. You told someone. Excellent. What about number three? We didn't have to study for the test. We were prepared for the test. Excellent. Number four. I know Jane didn't like my cooking, but she didn't need to be so rude about it. Jane was rude to me. Jane was rude to me. Exactly. Very good. Any questions about this on how to use uh, these structures to talk about ideas in the past tense? Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Bless you. Thank you. Thank you. Okay. What was she doing? What's the name of that action? Snoring. Sneezing. 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 <laughs> so what do you say when someone sneezes? God bless, bless you. you. Bless, bless you. you. Exactly. All right. So let's go here. Uh -huh. Do you like to go to restaurants? Yes. Yeah. I, yeah. I love. I love. In my case, I love. Okay. Do you usually go back to the same restaurant or do you experience something new every time you go to a restaurant? In my case, in different restaurants. Okay. All right. Can you see the questions? Yeah. 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 Okay. So uh, let me magnify so it's more legible. Okay, can someone take an image and send it to the WhatsApp chat, please? Okay, let me do it. Please. So this conversation is for you to improve your fluency, your accuracy, and at the same time, give your opinion about uh, um, uh, that you usually go. Thank you, Santi, and thank you, Noe. All right, so let me prepare um, the rooms. Uh -huh. Breakout rooms, recreate, recreate. Okay, uh, add a room. So we will move this person and this person. So let me see, I wanna make sure everybody has a partner. 
Okay. Great. So here we go. More students uh, agree with with that. Uh, uh, with the schedule, teacher, we were yes. we, we were talking about the schedule. <laughs> we, what we, schedule? The uh, in summer night schedule. to ten p.m. <laughs> maybe it, it, it was better at eight at eight p.m. to nine p.m. Maybe nine p.m. Okay. <laughs> We we did our classes yeah. from eight to nine. Really? Yeah, yeah. So we but when, with a different model. Uh oh, that's a good question. That's a very good question. I'm not sure if they have the same level from eight to nine. Maybe they do. Maybe they don't. Mm -hmm. Now, when you register, did you choose this hour or English Corporativo gave it to you? English um, Corporativo gave us. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, nine to ten is a little bit tired, you know, a little uh, bit. Tired. We, we, feel, we feel a little sleepy. <laughs> right, right, yeah. And especially. And I feel a little, a little zombie. <laughs> <laughs> Same here. Yeah, yeah, I get up around the 4 a.m. Right, oh, I was going to wow. tell you that. Especially if you wake up early, you would feel tired at this time. Yeah. Right. <laughs> so you wake up at 4.30 every day. Do every you? day. Every day. What time yeah, do you start day. working? Wow. Um, around 6 a.m. Yeah. Yeah. But, yeah. But I take a shower very, very slowly. early. Oh. And slow I and eat very slowly. <laughs> right. I work home office, so I I woke up at I wake up at uh seven AM around uh -huh. seven AM. Or okay. seven thirty. Okay. Yes. Okay. Yeah. Okay, yeah. So from eight to nine, you know, like uh, if if you think that nine to ten is a little bit too late, eight to nine is a better option. Yeah, totally, to totally agree. Okay, good. By the way, it's, yeah, it's good to see you again. Yeah, same here. Yeah. So some of you guys disappear. Yeah, <laughs> but the last week was uh, a very long week and a, a very busy week. So right. I call him. Uh, connect. I couldn't connect uh, into the classes, into yeah. the room. Okay. Yes. All right. Are you working in the platform? Uh, not yet, but uh, I'm going to start it this week or okay. maybe tomorrow. Right. Yeah. All right. Good, good. Nice. Nice to hear that. Best Yes, who doesn't? <laughs> but Yes, we can go very frequently. 
no we can go uh, we can go uh, uh, so many times <laughs> yes yeah. because for example i like some restaurants that are expensive no no it's not the same if i'm not mistaken they used to have one near to the uka but i think that it's not there anymore so okay, the, maybe. the one that i know it, i think there is the the only one they have it's the, the one is located in santa teca what's the name the, what's the name again please uh, pizzeria italia pizzeria. italian pizza yeah. i have eaten is it one good? pizza Pizzeria yeah, Italia. absolutely. It's very, it's really, really good. Yeah. Is it home style? Is it like homemade? Yeah, home style. Yeah. Have you visited? It? No, Pizzeria? never, never. I, you, I have heard comments go. about it, but I never been there. Santa yeah, Pizza you should Pizzeria go there. Okay. It's very delicious. Yep. And, and what about the prices? Well, it's not uh, yeah, cheap, Santa but. I don't think that it's expensive either. So. Okay, fifteen dollars for a large pizza, maybe. Yeah, maybe if you go with two 16. more people, you can spend like fifteen or twenty dollars. Okay. And you get full. Yeah. All right. Right. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good. Yeah. Maybe I'll 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 visit whenever I get the the first chance. And I have passed by there a thousand times, but I never been there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. Yeah. It's, okay. It's, it's very, it's very good. Good. I was. What they don't have this, so they should have okay. known. <laughs> In which restaurant? Uh, like, let me see. Uh, sometimes the the, you know, the sushi restaurants when they sell sushi. Okay. Or let me see. Yes, I, I love, it doesn't have, uh, not a specific restaurant, but it has happened or sometimes like it takes too long, you know, when to serve the food. Okay. Yeah. Yes, that happens sometimes. Or, or they uh, take you something that you have in order. Yes. <laughs> so you have to complain about it. <laughs> No, in, in my case, I, I never complained about the food or service in a restaurant. Sometimes I do because, like, from the beginning, for example, if I'm going to order, like, a soup, I ask them to please uh, serve it, you know, hot, because I know I don't like cold food. So I always tell them, please make sure, you know, the soup, it's hot. Okay. It's boiling. Uh -huh. and, and then when they take it to the table, it's cold. So I have to say I don't like it. I already, you know, explained to them how I want it. So that's kind of like com complaining. Yes. You know, <laughs> that, that happens with the, how can I say, option? Option? Like, no, like uh, the, the, of the sake, como el término. Uh, what do you mean? El, el grado de, 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 de cocción of the oh, steak. Oh, okay. Uh, yeah, the level of the cooking. Okay. Uh -huh. That happens sometimes when you order a, a level of the cooking of the steak and you got it wrong. Right, right. Yeah, you know, like if, if you're being very specific and you tell the waiter or waitress, look, this is how I want the food. I mean, they that's that's why you're, you're, you're paying, so they can follow your instructions, right? Yes, definitely, yes. Yeah. Like when you order eggs, I like them. <laughs> I like them soft, you know. Okay. The, not well okay. cooked. Right. And when they give me the eggs like really hard, I get mad because <laughs> I, I, I already told them at the beginning, you know, please have it like this. Right, so. right, right. Yeah, and, and even when you tell them beforehand, look, this is how I want my food, they don't listen. They're like, oh, she'll eat it, you know. So. Yeah, I know. <laughs> yeah, but 
But it, it's not the way it should be. That's correct. They should be a little yes. bit uh, more different. So, for example, a sushi bar, a seafood bar, a okay, it sounds a really good. dessert bar. It sounds that like I should go there. Yeah, you have to. You should try. If a dollar is good, good. Bien gastados, how do you say? Good. Well spent. <laughs> yeah, good spent. Well, yeah. <laughs> Which restaurant are you talking about? I said do Brazil. Paiscas do Brazil. Okay. And how, what are the prices there? Actually, I think it's cost $30. For With one dish? With, no, no, you can no, eat no, whenever you all want. You can eat. Oh, all, all you, you can, can eat. eat. Yeah. Okay. You're talking about lunchtime or dinner time? It's lunchtime, dinner time, and then also have breakfast. Okay, but breakfast, I imagine, is less expensive? Yeah, breakfast is like $20, I guess. Right, and I imagine that they have variety. Yeah, I would, I would tell them that, for example, you can eat all kind of meat. There is a sushi bar, there is a dessert bar, there is a salad bar. Uh, they give you, ah, there is a seafood bar, so you can eat whatever you want. And Good. there is, you have a, I don't know how to say, but you have a, something in your, in your table that uh -huh. you put it on the green side and they say that you have the green side and then begin to, to serve you whatever you, you ask. But when you feel really full, you turn the, the car to uh -huh. wet okay. and when they see, they don't uh, offer you anything else. Okay. Oh, okay. All right. Okay. It sounds like a good place, yeah. All right. Yeah, you, you should try. <laughs> do you remember how to say are you not in English? No. You say yeah, fast. Fast? Fast. Oh. Fast. So in those occasions, I think it's a good idea to fast uh, <laughs> for a couple of hours before. Yeah, yeah we yeah, only day. <laughs> have milk for breakfast. So you bring then, all your best appetite. Oh, yeah. <laughs> So you don't make any faces to the food. Yeah. All right. It's one meal for a day because at night you don't want to see any food. Right. Because you are still full. <laughs> right. Okay, good. Hello, hello. Hi. Hi. Did you guys finish talking about restaurants? Yes. yes. What is your favorite restaurant, Jose? Mine, in my case, it's a um, restaurant. is Asian food. Okay. It calls Li Fon. Is it Do Korean? You know? No. It, it sounds a little bit familiar, but honestly, I've never been to, to, to it. It's near Maferrer. Okay. And that station, it's a small restaurant. Oh, is it next to a uh, uh, um, subway? Subway, right in the Texaco yes. gas station. Yes. Okay. That restaurant. Okay, good. What about you? Uh, I like seafood and Mexican. Yeah, Mexican food is the best. <laughs> I can eat. I like el zócalo. Burritos, tacos, breakfast, lunch, and dinner, and I'll never get tired. Sokol is pretty good. Sokol is good. Yeah, yeah, it's good. All right, let's go back to the main mm -hmm. session. Okay. Okay. Jose has questions. Oh. Yes, uh, Jose? Uh, no, but about I, I the have platform. a question. Yes, in the platform. Oh, okay. What, what about the platform? In the exercise 1.2, uh -huh. in number six, okay. I got it wrong. Okay. I put the exactly answer that the, that you shown us. Okay. But I worry, I got it wrong. Okay. Are you sure you're not leaving any spaces between the words or any periods you're not supposed to write? No. Okay. Also, I check the apostrophes. Okay. Send me a send me a WhatsApp and explain what sections you're talking about so I can double check. Okay. It's fine. All right. Good.
Okay, so what is the name of your favorite restaurant and why? Do you have a favorite restaurant? I don't. No? It's very hard to choose a restaurant. Right. Yeah, <laughs> yeah. only one. <laughs> only one. <laughs> yeah, we were telling that it depends on the kind of food. If it's Mexican, if it's Italian, if it's pizza. Right. It's hard Chinese. Um, yeah. Right, right. Yeah, it is difficult to say, this is my favorite restaurant. Because even if you really love the food, there are days when you want to try something different. And, and then you go to another option. Yeah. Okay. And what about you? What, what is your restaurant favorite? favorite? Uh, you know, like you said, I really don't have a favorite restaurant. Um, when I go outside, you know, it depends who I'm with. Uh, mm -hmm. I usually, when I have the chance, I do you know where Metro Cafe is? Next to Centro Cultural? Yep. Right yes. There. Right I there. hear about it. Yeah, the prices are good. There is variety of food. The service is good. What so, is that? Different Metro Centro? No, it's next to Centro no. Cultural. It's Metro Cafe. Do you know where the pharmacy mm. of Seguro Social is? Yeah. Yes, in Metro Galerias. Metro, in Metro Galerias. Galerias. That's, ah, the okay. That's the name. Yeah. So it's in the lobby. The lady has like four different spaces that all of them they sell food and the food is really good really really good mm -hmm. yep. so i guess that's that's a place that i consider uh worth visiting whenever i have the chance you know but I, I, is very it, cheap. what is it it's very cheap exactly 250 or three dollars you get a, a monster lunch and good food good food <laughs> but i eat everything i how, what is it? We're going to visit that place. Sure, sure. You should. And I guarantee you something. If you go one time, you will come back. Okay. I okay. guarantee you that one. I will okay. keep it in mind. Sure. Do it. Do it. All right. So we're going to stop right here. Um, sorry for that. I lost connection for a couple of minutes. And we continue tomorrow. Same place, same time. Have a good night. <laughs> Good night, guys. Good night, everybody. Good night. Bye bye. Thank you. Bye. 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 bye.